Hi YouTube. Happy Wednesday. And thank you for tuning in to the Rainy Day Writing Guild. My name is Jake. And I guess we've got a few introductory questions for you. Start with favorite protagonist. I, uh, gosh, there's so many to choose from. Uh, so I'm not going to commit. So there. Favorite book, uh, definitely the, any of the Powder Mage series from Brian McClellan. It's kind of like steampunk, but it's not steam. It's all magic gunpowder. It's good stuff. Uh, physical versus ebook. Definitely physical book. Gotta feel the paper in your fingers. Uh, pen and paper versus computer. Uh, definitely computer, because I make too many grammatical errors to have to scratch out in pen or erase with pencil. So, gotta type it all. Uh, genre I write in. Uh, it's fantasy. Sometimes alternate history, uh, but definitely fiction, uh, definitely uh, warfare kind of stuff. Guns and battles and ships and silly things. Uh, let's also do the Oxford comma. Yes, so... Yes. <laughs> the Oxford comma is definitely always an, a thing that must, must, must be. Uh, it, it reminds me of that there's a meme or something uh, about the strippers JFK and Stalin I'm sure you've heard this one uh, but if, depending on where you whether you include the comma or not uh, changes vastly the meaning of the sentence alright uh, period inside the parentheses uh, no period always outside because if you're putting something into parentheses, it's like not a complete thought or an afterthought, an addendum. So it doesn't really warrant its own punctuation. So you always put the period outside to complete the rest of the thought. Oh, cat person, dog person, definitely doggo. Uh, and if you saw Joy's video on Sunday, you saw short snippet of Teddy, our terrified terrier, and he's totes adorbs, so there. Uh, greatest fear? Loneliness? Uh, zodiac sign. I'm an Aquarius. Um, Myers-Briggs? I took that test once. I don't remember what I got. Werewolf versus Vampire? Uh, I'm gonna take a different tack and go werewolf for a change. Hold on, traffic. Hello again. Uh, so, where do we go? Werewolf versus Vampire. Uh, definitely going to go with the Lycanthrope, just to be different. Uh, not a huge fan of the sparkly vampire silliness. So, uh, there's that. Also, is free will real? I work for the government, so that's a hard no. Uh, music or silence? Um, definitely music. Uh, in silence, I, I can't focus or get anything done I get too easily distracted so I definitely have to listen to something uh, I listen to a lot of uh, J-pop K-pop um, various EDM uh, that sort of thing anyway so thank you Joy for starting the channel uh, thank you Guy for that very surreal video on Monday and thank you Riley for doing the good work. Alright, this is Jake signing off. Tune in tomorrow for Brandon, and we'll see you next week. Take care, guys.